So I just saw this comment and I'm guessing she's referring to chicken pox as we do not inject anyone with herpes or what we normally call herpes simplex virus which causes cold sores. So is chicken pox the same as herpes? Let's talk about it. There is a group of viruses called the herpes viridae or herpes viruses. These viruses are different but they may have some similar symptoms like a blister like rash and they are highly contagious. Members of this family are the varicella zoster virus which causes chicken pox. You have herpes zoster which is when chicken pox reactivates later in life leading to what we call shingles. Herpes simplex 1 and 2 which cause cold sores and genital herpes. And finally we have Epstein-Barr virus and cytomegalovirus. Viruses like the varicella virus and herpes simplex virus are lifelong infections and they tend to stay dormant within your nervous system. By staying dormant in the nerves, you can have episodes of reactivation. In the US, the varicella zoster vaccine against chicken pox is given to children, adolescents, and adults without an evidence of immunity, as this will help prevent primary infection, prevent severe illness, and also reduce the spread of chicken pox. So yes, although you get vaccinated against chicken pox, this vaccine does not give you an infection with herpes simplex that will lead to cold sores later in life.